If you have to do shakara as a lady, do shakara. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new on my channel, you're very much welcome. My name is Arnold and I'm so happy and delighted to have you on my channel. If you are new and you haven't subscribed to this channel, please click the red button down here is the red button and also there's a notification bell icon just beside the subscribe button. Click on that so you can get my notification straight to your phone whenever I upload a new video. So guys, today I want to answer all your questions regarding my triple mark. Honestly, I received lots of messages on Facebook, on Instagram about my triple mark and mostly from people who ask triple mark too. And at some point, I was just thinking, honestly, people are going through a lot a lot lot with this triple mark issue and with the amount of messages that i received i was like maybe i can be an ambassador for people with triple mark or you know like a voice or i don't know what would be the best thing to do to kind of help because honestly it takes people who have triple mark to know how it feels if you don't have it honestly you don't know how it feels to have one so I want to quickly answer some of the questions that I got from people. So I got this message from someone, I'm not going to mention the name. So this person said, um, you are a motivator. Watch your YouTube channel today about Trevor Mark. I used to follow you on Instagram. Never knew you had a YouTube channel. Thank you so much. Um, my own Trevor Mark is even worse than yours, but I have n never let it put me down for once. That's very, very good. I'm really happy to hear this. Um, thank God you you find your husband the challenge now is no man wants a lady with triple mark babe that's not true there are lots of guys out there that will marry you with your triple mark you need to stop seeing the triple mark on your face you do not have triple mark like it's not it's just like one more makeup to your face see it as a tattoo don't see it as a triple mark see it like a tattoo that you put on your face to make you look beautiful you are beautiful with your triple mark and the right man will find you with or without triple mark so don't worry about the triple mark on your face regarding your marriage it affects nothing the right man will always come so i'm just quickly gonna um read through the message i pray to get married and be happy like you someday i love you ma Thank you so much and I love you so so very much. Do not worry, the right man will find you. And don't let this shaman mark make you settle for less. Do not settle for less. Eh? If you have to do shakara as a lady, do shakara. Do shakara because like that's how you feel. Like don't let that shaman mark limit you. Don't let that shaman mark stop you from being angry when you're supposed to get angry. There are times where you're supposed to get angry when we see things that make you angry in a relationship. Don't let your chopper mark make you accept what you do not normally accept. Act normally. If you're angry and you normally act angry, act angry. Don't let your chopper mark make you be like, ha, huh, if I'm angry now, maybe you will leave me and go. Please don't settle for less. Tribal mark does not define who you are. Do not see it as a tribal mark. See it as a tattoo that you intentionally put on your face to beautify you. You are beautiful, like I said, with or without your tribal mark please start seeing yourself as like that though i presently study in a country i'm not going to mention the country i love it better abroad because no one even makes jest of me here unlike our motherland where we were given these marks so that is just the message and then i chatted with her just to like comfort her honestly it's a big shame whereby in our own country i talk about my experience with this triple mark when i was in nigeria how i was unable to get a job because of my triple mark i have i have a video about that on my channel so like it's a big shame whereby the culture that actually gives this thing to us abuses us because this is the culture where we're coming from and this is the culture that gave us the triple mark so it's a really really big shame and so i received this message from someone um the person said I'm not going to mention the person's name. Um, yes, I've been seeing your wonderful videos online and it has really helped me. I have a big and deep treble mark on my right cheek there. This has affected me in school and in many areas. Even in class of 50, I notice, um, I notice myself as the only person having treble mark. So there, 
Even till now, I hate it. It makes me feel angry and so ashamed walking on the road or I feel so ashamed to be in a crowd. Damn, when people mock, insult, laugh at me, even in my quarters there, I feel myself as the ugliest one. Please advise me, mama. <laughs> I really hate it being among friends and I am the only one having it. And the insult and laugh mocks me sometimes i don't carry out my certain just or fear of insult i see that you have really overcome it i pray god really help me from this mind disturbance i wonder if i will even see a wife in the future that will really love me oh cause mine is big and deep and they see it also please dear advise me to really be happy chai god You know yourself, I'm, I don't want to mention names, but I know how you feel because I've been there. Like, I know exactly how it feels to have a chopper mark in the midst of people who don't and people who see themselves as superior because they do not have chopper mark. I know how it feels. I do. But I also need to tell you that you are the only one who can help yourself. Honestly, nobody else can help you. You need to start helping yourself by telling yourself you are beautiful because if you don't see that beauty from inside if you don't see that beauty in yourself nobody will see that beauty in you like you need to act confidently you need to act like you're just like every other person out there without chamber mark like take chamber mark of your of your mind see yourself as normal regular people out there you're not in any way different from them you need to act normally in their midst because when you start acting like they are more beautiful than i am they are better than me then they start treating you like that teach them how they'll treat you teach them how you want to be treated honestly you need to start being confident because your confidence when you are confident in yourself when they see that confidence in you then they will respect you they will look beyond the trouble mark and actually the trouble mark on your face does not actually stop you from being who you are does not stop you from getting a wife yeah about the wife issue do not worry you are going to find your own wife that will love you for who you are that will look beyond the chamber mark that will not even see that chamber mark in you it, it, the person will not even see that you have chamber mark if there's anyone that looks down on you or does not like you does not want to be in a relationship with you because you have a chamber mark that person is not meant for you so i'm just going to move on quickly to this this person sent me a whole like a lot of messages and i cannot read everything it's just so so very much but i'm just gonna read like the major point that i feel is important please may i know the meaning of your chamber mark because i learned chamber marks are for beautification identification and other reasons some really like it others wish their chamber mark were cleared or removed excuse me therefore even cover them with their veil or they don't want to show them when they are taking pictures some are even frustrated with the max but they can't remove it so first the person said that um i learned chamber mark are meant for beautification identification and other reasons yes you are very very right those days chamber mark were meant for um beautification actually mine was for beautification not for identification mine was not for identification so mine was for beautification and some then somewhere for identification and yeah for other reasons spiritual reasons as well but mine was majorly for beautification so i'm just going to quickly mention that um like my real thought about this like i feel there is no need for trauma mark in this age that we are right now i know it is an african culture and i do respect african culture i am an african like a very very deep rooted african person at that but i feel like there are some things that are better left behind us like we should stop this chamber mark of the thing because let the child grow up and decide whether or not he or she wants chamber mark on my last on my previous chamber mark videos i had someone commenting that he would love to get a chamber mark if i can help him to get contact of who can do it for him there are people like that that will love it after they are grown let them take that decision but right now like if chamber mark was for identification purpose okay these days and this age that we have now there are id cards for everybody like you can get your id the social security numbers that people do have like 
and if you are talking about beauty if people really want treble mark to beautify themselves there's eye pencil that people can use to put there and there are several makeups that we do these days that treble mark would not be necessary and there can be tattoo like uh, temporary treble marks that you can take off whenever you want you can put on whenever you like you know i feel like treble mark should stop yes it should stop so this person i'm going to continue reading this person's message but i realize you are okay with your treble mark and you look motivational is there any means of is there, is there any means to remove the treble mark in order to avoid challenges behind it really i do not know if yeah i think there are some beauty cosmetics salons that do um remover or treble mark i've seen or i've heard of one in finland in Sinki, where i live i've not been there before but i've seen the adverts online that they can remove it but i do not want to so that's why i've not gone there but if there's anyone who wants to remove it yeah there are places that can help you with that if you really want to remove your treble mark we were taught at school that treble mark and facial marks should be abolished and stopped because it disfigures persons people's face or does not make them look beautiful or handsome as they claim it's for it's for beautification it can lead to transmission of diseases and infection since the knives or blades used for the marks are mostly not sterilized this is very very true the first one i mentioned that earlier then also the second one yeah it can lead to infections and it's dangerous diseases yeah it's dangerous it is very painful and can lead to excessive bleeding very true and it is done without the consent of the children hence it's against the right of the child so in these days where the right of the child matters the four things this person mentioned in this message is very very correct and i totally support this person i'm just going to say the first name of that person nana you are very very correct and i appreciate your detailed message the message are still so on and on on and on like a lot of messages i received from nana like oh my god it's such a long one you can see <laughs> from a single person you can see it's so long but yeah i'll just stop at that but you are very very correct with your points and in this age we should start supporting people like when you see people with trouble mark please don't look down on them like they did not intentionally put that thing on their faces and even if they did like it's their choice please don't disrespect people because you think we are more beautiful than them please don't look down or look less on people with treble mark they are just normal people like you and they are beautiful that treble mark does not make them less of a person and i hope this video has been able to like motivate you encourage you ginger you like give you that that, that that's trend of yes i'm going out there to the world and be myself and show my talent i'm not gonna let this travel mark hold me back so basically that is all i want to discuss in this video the major purpose of this video is just to like educate people with travel mark or encourage them that you are beautiful even with your travel mark it is beautiful you look beautiful and the right man will come you can achieve anything without your treble mark so yeah thank you so much guys for watching i really appreciate your attention <laughs> it's been a long video i really appreciate you guys watching so guys thank you so much for watching if you haven't subscribed to my channel please click the subscribe button click the like button i'll see you guys in my next video bye